wanna shine Like the sun when it comes up Run the city from the rooftops Cause today's gonna be my day's gonna be my day's 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 Good night stress, see you in the morning I don't gotta guess, you're always there for me Get out of bed, stay up, stay out of my head cause it's dangerous And I don't wanna lose my mind, no I'm finally going to actually update on what's going on in this vlog because I realize it's probably a little confusing, but I'm in Lake Louise uh, for the World Cup. It's my first World Cup in like three years or four years now, so it's a big deal for me and I'm really excited. Um, today was actually the first race, so it's Friday today. On Tuesday, we did our first training run. The weather was so horrible. The snow was horrible. Um, honestly, it was just not the most fun day, but um, I did okay on the training run. And then we, the last two days, Wednesday and Thursday, Wednesday fully got canceled. It was dumping and windy and disgusting. So then yesterday, Thursday, we got to do some GS training, like two runs because the snow was a bit soft. And then just free ski a bit to get the legs going. And then today we finally raced. It's Friday. I started bib 50, which there's only 52 girls racing. And I ended up coming 38th, um, which is my best result here and my best World Cup result. So pretty excited about that. I think that I had bigger like result goals for myself, but obviously I'm just really happy that I skied well and that I would say like executed our plan that we had so yeah i'm honestly just tired it's already 4 30. we only got back from the hill at like 3 30 um and we were at the hill at 8 15 so it was a really long day it was really fun it's downhill's so fun and yeah so um i guess the rest of this vlog will be the next two days of racing hopefully the both races Saturday and Sunday go off the downhill and then the other wait the other downhill and then the super G and yeah I'm just honestly I'm just lying in bed I have friends and family events in 30 minutes so I'll probably go shower and get ready for that <laughs> okay I'll um I'll let you know when something else exciting happens but yeah <laughs> see ya I just wanna shine Like the sun when it comes up Run the city from the rooftops Cause today's gonna be my day's gonna be my day's 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 Good night stress, see you in the morning I don't gotta guess, you're always there for me So I never see you to doubt I think you like seeing me freak out in the morning. Hello. This vlog has made basically no sense. I wouldn't even consider it a vlog, but I, <laughs> I had a really good week. It was so busy, which is why obviously I didn't have time to film anything. We basically every day got up around, I don't know, 7.30, go eat. We would leave for the hill at like 9 a.m. and then we would inspect, free ski, and then the race would start around 12.30. But for us starting, like I was starting 50 something, I would only run around like 2.15 in the afternoon. 
And so if you think about it, if I only got down at like 2.15, I had to get all my stuff together, get back in the car, get back to the hotel. By the time we would eat lunch, we missed lunch a couple times because it was closed at 3.30. So eat lunch at like 3.30 or 4. And then I basically just survived after that. Like I would do recovery in my room and eat dinner and go to sleep because the days were just really long. It was a really cool experience. I managed to come 38th, 39th, and 41st, I think, which are good for me. I scored in downhill, which is like not a normal thing in World Cup, I guess, but my points were so high that it happened. Let's see. Nothing else exciting really happened <laughs> other than we got to race. And yeah, now I am done the World Cup for this week and we decided that I'm going to stay and do the Noram to try and win the Noram downhill title. So I'm here until next Friday and then I'll fly back to Europe on the 11th of December and hopefully all of that will go well. Hopefully I'll get some more World Cup spot starts or if not just at least Europa Cup starts and kind of get going in the European circuit. So that's all from me. It was a really amazing first World Cup back. I've really missed it. It was so great to see all the Canadian fans out there. Yeah, I'm just very grateful, very lucky to be here. And if you are out there freezing your butt off in Lake Louise, thank you for coming. If you watched online, thank you so much. And if you were just cheering from afar, I love you. So make sure to keep watching my vlogs hopefully i'll have them updated more regularly with races and i do have a new website that has all of my information and everything so i'll link that down below and i'm started oh my gosh i forgot to tell you guys this this is really exciting i started a podcast that was the big thing i was talking about in my update vlog i started a podcast um i'm uploading this on be like two days after my first episode goes out so Make sure to check it out. It's called Send It With Steph. I will link it down below as well. Thank you for all the support. And I would not be able to do all of this without the support of you guys, but also the support of all my amazing sponsors, friends, family, coaches. So thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe and like this video. And I'll see you in the next one. Oh.